uh, space curves. And we can consider a part, uh, particle moving through space uh, during a time interval. Its coordinates are functions of t. Uh, for example, our airplane in the space. Its coordinates is uh, uh, its coordinates are functions of t. We can write as x, y, z. The x is function of t, y is function of t, g t, g t, and z is a function of t, we can write as kt. Or sometimes we write as a vector function. Because we know any point in the space can determine or uh, can determine a vector, so a point in the space and is sometimes equivalent to a vector. Uh, actually, this um, this vector we call we call this vector as a um, position vector. Axis is R. This is the curve R T. This is the origin, and it's Is, this is RT. We can write this as RT. The, the vector is change, change time to time. This is a vector. This is a vector function. For example, there's we can draw a graph like if rt equals cosine t, sine t, and t. That means x equals cosine t, y equals sine t, and z equals t. Or we can write it cosine t i plus sine t j plus t k. This uh, uh, this vector function or this curve that actually we can write as x square plus y square equals one for any x, uh, for any point for any point in the uh, for any point in the curve the x coordinate and the y coordinate are in the in the is in a circle, but z is change the the constant speed as one. So x, so the curve is like this because x and y, x and y is in a circle, and z. Z increases by a constant speed by one. It's the same speed with t. If we call the t is is the uh, t is the is the angle between this point and this point and x axis. This is a T. We can draw a graph from here. X, Y in the uh, in the circle 
x coordinates and y coordinates in the circle, and uh, z has this constant with uh, the constant uh, speed with t. This uh, this is the graph and the function and uh, actually the, this can be write as a parametric equation for the curve. Uh, second, uh, we have some limit, the definition of limit and continuity of vector function. The vector function, first the, the limit The limit, the definition of limit. Uh, if the limit t points to t not r t equals some, the limit should the vector function, the limit of a vector function should be a vector. This means uh, for any epsilon greater than zero, uh, there exists delta greater than zero, such that when t minus t zero less than delta should be greater than zero, then the inequality uh, RT minus R uh, minus L the the length the length of RT minus L should less than than epsilon. This inequality holds. That's not uh, there's the uh, similar with the scalar function. The limit is uh, with this. The limit, the definition of limit of vector function is similar with scalar function. The second, the definition of continuity. If limit t approaches to t zero, r t equals the constant r t naught then we say that RT is continuous at T naught. And if RT continues at every point in the interval, we say that the RT is continuous on the interval. As they say, the, the same with scalar function. Uh, the third is derivative. The derivative of R T is defined as limit T tends to T naught. Then R T plus delta T minus R T over delta T. Oh, uh, we see that we use delta t here. Should delta t tends to zero as delta t, or r t the derivative of r t naught as t tends to t naught as r t minus r t naught over t minus t naught. That's the same as uh, similar, similar with the scalar function. If this is RT as RT naught is the origin as RT naught is RT. Then RT minus rt naught 
and then takes the d takes takes the limit is actually this vector. This vector is uh, by and then by the definition of of the tangent line, we notice that R T R T naught is tangent to R T at T equals T naught. We call this R T over R T naught the tangent vector. The, the derivative of RT is the tangent vector of RT. And some related definitions. Uh, the R prime T, sometimes we write as VT. This is the velocity. Sometimes we call this velocity or velocity vector or tangent vector. And the absolute value or the length of V, the length of V, sometimes we just write it as scalar V. We call this the speed. That's the, that's the magnitude of velocity. And acceleration, the, top, the, the second derivative of, of RT, we call this acceleration or acceleration vector. And uh, the v, the, the the unit vector of v that we call this the direction of motion. That's the re related definitions, and we say. Uh, we look for another example related to those definitions. If RT equals 2 cosine T, 2 sine T, and uh, 5 cosine square T, we want to find its tangent vector acceleration at 3 pi over 4 oh, 7 pi 7 pi over 4 now the tension vector or velocity the tension vector is the velocity velocity v t equals r prime t that is negative 2 sine t and 2 cosine t and uh, negative 10 sine t cosine t actually uh, sine t times cosine t that's, that is a one half sine 2 t so that is negative sine negative 2 sine t 2 cosine t and uh, negative 5 sine 2 t and uh, at 7 pi over 4 that is uh, sine t is negative at this point that is ne negative 2 times negative square root 2 over 2 
and 2 times square root 2 over 2 and negative uh, sine uh, that is the sine 7 pi so that this coordinate is 0 so that is square root 2 square root 2 and 0 and the acceleration acceleration of oh, acceleration sometimes we write it as a t the acceleration is the second derivative of r t so that is two, negative 2 cosine t negative 2 sine t and uh, 10 negative 10 cosine 2 t and then at 7 pi over 4 that is negative 2 times square root 2 over 2 negative 2 times negative square root 2 over 2 and cosine 7 pi cosine 7 pi is negative 1 so that is the result is negative square root 2 square root 2 and uh, 10 that's the acceleration and the uh, and the speed oh sorry this is not, uh, uh, that's uh, times cos and 2t cos and 2t that uh, when t equals 7 pi over 4 that is 7 pi over 2 that's 0 sorry this point is uh, this coordinate is 0 and uh, v the speed oh, the speed speed at that point Speed at that point uh, uh, square uh, seven pi over four. That is square root uh, two plus two plus zero. That is two. there any oh sorry uh, sine 2t sine 2t this is not zero sine 2t that is sine 7 pi over 4 7 pi over 4 sine 7 pi over 4 that is neg oh, 7 pi over 2 uh, that is 3 pi plus uh, 1 uh, 1 uh, pi plus pi over 2 so that is 7 pi over uh, 7 pi over 2 is this point so that is negative 1 so that is 5 that here is 5 so here is plus uh, as plus 25 that's square root 29 sorry that's the velocity and uh, velocity acceleration and speed for a uh, space space curve 